Sophie Briggs has come to ask her GP about genetic testing. Her brother Jonathan has haemophilia and she is worried that her unborn baby might also have it. Sophie has never been tested and the GP suggests taking a family history to see who is affected in the family. Right Sophie, so we'll start with you and I'll just confirm your details. So you're Sophie Briggs? Yeah. Okay. And your date of birth, if you could just confirm that for me? Um, so it's the 12th of May 1988. Okay. And you're currently six weeks pregnant, is that correct? Yes. Is this your first pregnancy? Yes, it is. Right, can you just give me some information about your partner? Uh, yes, yeah, so that's Chris. Um, we've been married five years and uh, we're really excited to have the baby. That's great news. Um, and what's Chris's date of birth? Um, so Chris is born on the 2nd of January 1988. Okay. And does he have any health problems at all that you're concerned about? No. And Chris's surname, is that Briggs as well? I know, Chris's surname is Thomas. Okay. And does Chris have any other children by a previous partner? No, he doesn't. Okay. And is there anything in Chris's side of the family that you're concerned about? Uh, no. Okay. So the rest of the questions I'll ask will be all about your side of the family. So you mentioned that you've got a brother, Jonathan, is that correct, who's got haemophilia? Yes. Do you have any other siblings? Yes, I do. Um, Jane. Okay, and do you all have the same parents? Yes, we do. Okay, so could you just start by giving me some information about Jane? Yep, yeah, so Jane's date of birth is the 7th of June, 1990. Okay, and does she have any health problems at all? No, she's very fit and healthy. And does Jane have any children? No. And her surname is Briggs? Yes. And Jonathan, is his surname Briggs as well? Yes, it is. Okay, and what's Jonathan's date of birth? Um, so 7th of July, uh, 1992. Okay, and he has haemophilia? Yes, he does. Okay, and apart from haemophilia, is there any other problems that you're concerned about, health problems that you're concerned about? Um, no. Okay, and does he have any children? No, he doesn't. Okay. Are you able to give me some information about your parents then? Um, yes, so uh, Dad is Robert. Um, his date of birth is the 19th of October, um, 1962. Oh, well, he does have a diabetes and heart disease. Mum is Bernadette, and her date of birth is the 5th of September, 1964. And does she have any health problems? Um, no, she doesn't. Um, it's just her brother that has haemophilia. Okay, so I'll come back to that um, brother in a moment. Just want to confirm that your dad and mum have the surname Briggs? Yes, they do. Okay. Right, and do you have any information about um, your dad? Does he have any brothers or sisters? Um, no, he doesn't. Okay, and do you have any information about his parents? Um, no, uh, well, my dad was adopted actually, okay. so um, we don't know anything about his birth family. Okay, so moving then on to your mother, you said that she's got a brother um, with haemophilia? Yes, that's Uncle David. Uncle David. And does your mum have any other brothers or sisters? Uh, no, she doesn't. And does she and Uncle David have the same parents? Uh, yes, they do, but uh, his surname is Foster. Okay. Right. And what's um, David's date of birth? Um, I know that he was born two years after Mum, uh, so 1966. Yeah. 
I'm really not sure of the date though, sorry. That's fine, that's not a problem at all. Okay, and your grandparents then on your mother's side of the family, have you got any information about them? Um, I don't really remember them actually. Um, they either died before I was born or when I was very young. Okay, and do you know what they may have died from? Um, well, I'm not sure, but actually my grandma, um, she had two brothers with haemophilia. Okay. Um, and they both died from that. Alright. And do you know whether it was confirmed that they had haemophilia? I think so, yes. Do you know what age they may have been when they died? Um, no idea, sorry. That's, that's not a problem. Okay, so is there any other information that you feel I should know about your family? Um, no, I, I'm, I don't think so. Everyone else is, yeah, that's okay. And I haven't missed anyone in the family? Um, no, I don't think so. And are you happy for me to share this information with my colleagues or perhaps other family members? Um, probably not my family. I don't really want my mum to know just yet, but healthcare professionals, yeah, that's fine. Okay, I'll just make a note of that here. Thank you very much for that information.